My girlfriend of eight years cheated on me with her coworker. Hi. This might be a little bit all over the place. I'm still trying to polish my thoughts about this. Sorry in advance. For those who wants the juicy parts, just skip our bio paragraph for general information. So we both just turned 26 in December, and we have been together for eight years now, since November. She's been working very stressful hour job, and honestly, we've been pretty depressed these past few weeks. I have issues feeling useless at my WHM job, and I'm struggling with weed, food, video games addiction for years now, even before I met her, just less intense since I lived with my parents and went to school. We also have a very cute seven years husky, which we kind of consider like our kid. Mieso has always been very friendly with males because she really dislikes spending time with females, stating drama and fakeness, which is fair in my opinion, but it has always been sensitive for me. We lived together for about two years now, and the bedroom time has been great for the first year. Good amount of interaction. But recently I'm falling off in my own patterns again, so I don't give her much attention. I game, I overeat, and basically am a piece of crap human being. So, I think, our recent lack of interaction has been due to this. But I found out a nude on her phone that wasn't meant for me, so I kind of checked her texts. Okay, not cool, I know, just to see evidence of her sending stuff to another male at her work. At first, I thought it was just nudes, so I get in bed with her. We have great sex, and then we listen to a Dr. K episode about relationships. I finally give in and confront her about the pictures, in which I finally learn that she cheated on me with the guy in his van. Not once, but two times at one-week intervals, with nudes sent to him in between and before, but not after. She definitely regretted it. I can feel it in her last texts to him and how she reacted when I found out. I've known her for over 10 years and it's literally the first time I see her breaking my trust. While she caught me lying to her about my weed consumption on multiple occasions. I tell her it's a shock. I'll need a week to think about what happens now. But um, mostly that I don't want to end the relationship if she shows that she really care about me and she cut ties with him. I'm a very rational guy. I genuinely don't care. She smashed her co-worker. I care about her not telling me about her feelings beforehand. I'd be happy in an open relationship or having planned switcheroo for partners. I'm just devasted that she would lie to me that way. I don't know what to think, how to act. I want to give her a second chance, but I so don't want to feel like a doormat and I want her to redeem the best way she can. What should I do? In what ways can she redeem herself? Should we tell our friend and families if we ever try with the second chance? Let's see the comments. You have to stop blaming yourself first of all. Her cheating on you is her fault alone. No matter how crappy you have been or how little attention you paid to her, that is not a justification. If you turn this around and you cheated on her, everyone would rightly blame you. Don't take this on you. It might be the cause, but not a reason. I'm sorry about being so negative here, but from what you're telling us, I don't buy her regret. If this was the first and last time she did something like this, why did she do it multiple times? If she really regrets it, why send nudes multiple times? Not much regret there yet until she was found out, no. Regardless of what you think about open relationships or anything like that, that's obviously only okay with prior consent of both parties. I'm not going to give advice if she deserves a second chance, because that's a decision you have to make on your own. Just from an outside perspective, this sounds more like she's sorry for being caught than anything else. OP, agree with what you say. I'll try to dig a little deeper, but from what I've heard it's because she felt good and validated while doing it. Sure, she knew I would be destroyed, but in her mind, I would have never found out, so everything would be okay. But I really would like to know why she kept doing it without remorse. I think that bigger problem than her cheating is that instead of confronting you about being unhappy, she decided to look for something outside of your relationship. 
It also seems that you too have ignored bad situation. So this is a wake up call. My decision how to act would be based not on what has just happened, but how she will act in next few months. I would try some form of couples therapy and also work with her on what makes both of you unhappy. If you see genuine intention and goodwill on her part to work with you on changing things for the better, then you will both be fine. Let's see uh, another story. Brother slept with my girlfriend. Disclaimer. I also posted this on another subreddit, so apologies if that's not allowed. This is a frustrating topic, so I'll get down to it. My brother, 31, has been known in our family as the sensible one for years, right up until he cheated on his ex-girlfriend with his current girlfriend a few years back. Everyone thought maybe it was just a mental thing he was dealing with, which is why I wanted to support him through it. I was with my ex-girlfriend, 27, from 2015 until 2021. Last year, she told me that she and my brother kissed on a family holiday in Mallorca in late 2019. I was furious but forgave her and we moved forward. We ended up breaking up back in April of this year. Unrelated to this, because we just weren't in love with each other anymore. I've been struggling with the idea of seeing my brother, who didn't know I knew, for a while. But I-25 decided I needed to let him know why I'd gone quiet on him. I asked my ex for details on what happened because I knew he'd try and deny it, but as it turns out, she admitted they slept together. And it wasn't just a kiss, just a one-off thing. I confronted my brother about it and told him I knew what happened, so he couldn't try and worm his way out of it. He has neither confirmed nor denied what happened, probably because he doesn't know what she's told me, but the whole thing is just a mess. He's implied she may be exaggerating some of it, but at this point, what would she gain from lying? She's in a new relationship. She's already told her new guy about this because... She wants a clean slate, and my brother has a history of cheating. I'm just struggling to wrap my head around it all, and I don't want to meet up with him because I just fear he's going to spin it. And the idea of seeing him makes me incredibly anxious. Let's see comments. Well, you got rid of the cheating, scummy girlfriend. Now write off that brother who did this and move on. No contact with either, forever. You've lost nothing worth having in either of these cases. Make sure everyone knows what they both did. I know I am going to get downvoted for this, but you should go see your brother and cave his face in. He keeps doing things like this because there are no consequences. He doesn't care who he hurts as long as he can get his rocks off. Seriously, it sounds like he needs a good ash whooping. Simple, never let your new GF or wife to be around him at all. When they ask why, just say my brother is a serial cheater and I do not want to put you in situation where he can try to come on to you and cause me to question his motives toward you. If it was my brother, I never talk to him again. A wife or a girlfriend in a betrayal that hurts, but it's ultimately someone who once was and now is a stranger start to finish. A best friend or brother sister. That's a connection forged by blood for life, for better or worse. He is your brother for life. Start to finish and you have a deep connection that transcends even marriage to the aforementioned. Which is why a betrayal of this caliber is more than enough to destroy someone. Why it's among the highest crimes between siblings. Why you have to be the most despicable kind of person to do that. To me, it's pretty obvious he's gone through a mental break and couldn't resolve his commitment to his first girlfriend who cares why, and then started cheating to cope. It's awful, but it does happen. Why that doesn't matter is that you're his freaking brother. He should have the decency to range for his debauchery outside of his own family. She's disgusting, yes, but he is far, far worse. Out him to your family, out her to anyone who asks. You owe neither of these gross people nothing, and your silence only offers them the opportunity to spin lies. I know you want to hear him admit it with his own words, but he's a coward and is ducking you because he fears the fallout. Waiting for the cathartic healing fantasy to happen is unwise. 
he will run away or turn your entire family against you before he will take accountability, at least until he's gone through therapy for his choices. P.S. Unimportant, but I bet a pinky she lied about telling him to keep you from doing it in fear of you outing her. It's your brother and he needs his ash. Beat you. Never put puss before blood. They are both low-life pieces of crap. She is a straight tramp no good will ever come her way, and your brother is a poor excuse for blood. God bless you, man wish you the best.